Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to some more Graveyard Keeper. I'm having a lot of fun with Graveyard Keeper, I must admit. Um, I did not expect to ever be, be having as much fun as I do, but man, I am having a good time. Uh, there's a lot of content, it seems at the very least, in the game so far, and that's all just going to get fleshed out and ironed out as the game progresses. So, uh, with that in mind, let's just continue with our quest to... What is this going to do? I got water? bucket of clean water all right uh let's continue to try and make our our home and our graveyard up to snuff i think our first main goal should be bring our graveyard to a point where we can open the church again let me get those um also did i get the upgrades or did that not save properly let's take a look real quick theology i already got those i guess we could like soft spares extra spares oh we also need to see if we can get a stamp so we can start selling off those things as well yeah, we got, um, firewood, huh? I wonder what firewood does. Mining? You know what? Let's actually go ahead and unlock the mining, uh, thing a bit. And then if we want to... No, we can't do anything there yet. Alright, that's fine, actually. I'm fine with that. Uh, let's actually swing into the graveyard and let's start looking at what we need to do for repairs. I do know what we're gonna need to actually do right out the gate is work on some headstones. So, why don't we go over here? We can craft, um some of these so we need some filch so let's go ahead and chop down some trees i hope trees grow back kind of naturally if they don't i'm gonna have to figure out a way to get them to it's through a farm or something all right no 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 oh, well actually yeah let's dig this up i know we're eating up a lot of our stamina and we need to be better at stamina management for the day um but we'll, we can do what we can do oh i gotta put them over here got it and then i think i guess we just take them from that storage and there's some rocks we can break down there, which we can't really do anything about yet. I'm curious. Let's take a look over here. Ore cutter. We, I mean, an ore cutter would be very good. I don't know what that would do for us. Sawhorse, which we already have. Stone stockpile. Increase my yard space. So that that's going to be what we want over time, is to increase our yard space. Can I do anything with this? Place for stones? Well, I don't have any stones. I was hoping for a place for ore, but... Doesn't look like we're gonna get that much. I bet you once we start getting um, better tools as well, uh, we're gonna eat, we're gonna eat up a lot less of our um, of our stuff. Man, we are just powering through all of our. Give me that, thank you. All of our stamina. It's it's insane. Let's just do another filch. We might as well use our logs. No sound effects for this though. All right, I'm gonna try and get ourselves on like a solid schedule, I think. Can't go in there. Can I please take that? All right, let's look at, um, this might be for gardening, which may be how we get, you know, trees and stuff. Property of the, uh, in forfeiture, for commercial use, contact the town owner, Heradric. Oh, all right, so I can't, I gotta buy this from uh, Heradric, I guess. That's all right. All right. I need to find the Inquisitor as well. Why don't we swing into town? Is there really not like a journal for my quests or anything? I wish there was. All right, well, do I have a body in the in the morgue? I completely forget if I have a body in the morgue. Not something you want to hear your gravekeeper say out loud either, by the way. Uh, do, I, do I have a body? Do, your loved one? Do I need to bury your loved one? I forget. I do not, which is good. All right. Let's swing into town, um, and we're just gonna try and, I guess, kill the day off by, uh, by just kind of seeing people around town, and we'll try and get to bed, like I said, at a reasonable hour, and get our character on a schedule. It seems as though days are gonna go by a lot faster, um, as time goes on. Path is closed, and, okay, so we can only go up there on this particular day, which is fine. We're gonna have a body when we get back, also fine. Just wanted to see if I could break those. I think I tried that before, and it didn't work, but I had to try. And we'll swing into the village. Maybe we'll just follow the roads a little bit and see if we can explore some more. How's it going? Hey, how are you? Can I talk to you? F. No, E. Trade. Beeswax, honey, bees, bees, bees. So I can buy bees and um, beekeeper stuff from him. Good to know. And you? You milk farm animal stuff. Interesting. I wonder what that'll be used for 
at some point. I wonder if those characters will get fleshed out in any way. But I'm gonna keep following the roads and, and kind of explore areas I haven't checked out yet. This guy is a tinker. And there is actually right here, locked an alpha version. So there is gonna be more to him, I guess. Or more to these characters, rather. And I'm excited to see if they like implement storylines with all the characters and, and try and make this town kind of like a living, breathing town as opposed to a hub where you just kind of trade and stuff. And it seems like that's at least what they're trying to do a little bit. This is like a forest of some sort. With some hidden paths. Interesting. That's like a castle tower? Can I go underneath? No. We should start like, heading back soon. And oh, there's another path over here. I wonder if this is open yet. The path to war camp is closed in the alpha version. All right, a war camp. Man, there's just way more in this game than I expected. Who are you? Locked in alpha. God, all right, all right, all right. There's there's going to be a lot of content in this game. This is why I said I only wanted to do a few episodes uh, of this as well, because it's it seems promising. Like, the game seems very, very promising. And one of the things I don't like doing very often uh, is, is fully kind of exploring every inch of content in an alpha game um for because then when the game comes out it feels like i'm kind of retreading old ground over and over again i don't really want to do that it kind of kills a lot of the magic for when the game comes out all right not much going on here so come morning uh why don't we this is the dead horse in actually we have a, a body certificate we want to sell off so let's actually go ahead and do that real quick. Who are you? Are you just a town guard? We can talk in the day, not now. All right, sorry. Hey, guys. How's it going? I'm here to uh, sell some stuff. We got three of them. A little bit of money. And I still can't find the stamp. Uh, no. I'll, I'll take it. I need to find Snake or do it the right way. It does seem like there's going to be two options of doing it. Who are you? Our oh, bad luck not today. And then there's that person. And then there's Mrs. Chain. You better talk with my husband. He's in charge here. All right, well. And I can't go up there yet. I can... Doors closed until I have 50 happiness with Haradric. All right. And we can't go in there yet either. All right. Good. You can definitely see some of the Stardew influence at the very least. All right, let's swing back. Man, the time, days go by so fast. Like a lack of, of measurement in time is throwing me nuts. Who are you? Greetings. <gasps> uh, greetings, villager. If you have any spare of her, I can offer you amazing things, tasty and rare. I humbly apologize, but I won't buy you sh <gasps> stuff unless it's something valuable. And now you can find some uh, like that here. All right, I'm actually new here. Everybody thinks I'm thinks I'm the keeper of the local graveyard, but I'm from another world. I need to go back. I understand you all too well. This world is not mine either. Oh, thank God. Mine is a world of grandeur. The palaces of the town, but I'm not so lucky to be highborn, so I have to earn my coins here in this onion potato hell. Scare him to cure his hiccups. Boo. Are you mad? What are you doing? I was only trying to help you with your hiccups. It was a stupid move. I just need some time. The shark fin steak I ate this it was so delicious, but I have to admit that the gold friend butterfly wing stole the show. Seems like you're okay now after my little surprise attack. Yeah, seems so. All right, what does he got? Jewelry, jewelry, grape seed, grape seed, and then a bunch of other things. Okay, cool. I tried to sprint. It's not working so well. Are these my footprints from earlier? Yeah. Weird that the footprints actually stay that long. I figured they fade away long before then, but oh no, nope. that's where they seem to end right there. Honestly, I'm a fan of the music. <laughs> it's really good. Like I, I, the the atmosphere and ambiance of this of this uh, of this game is is enjoyable. All right, let's go ahead and throw the body in, in the morgue at the very very least. Go ahead and grab that. Not enough energy. I'll see you later. So much work to do, not enough energy to do it. 
I am but a man from another world, a modern world even. And here I am, left to my own devices. Can I actually pop that? No? Alright. Sleep it up. Sleep it, baby, sleep it. Come on. I'm, I'm, it's gonna be nighttime, which is kind of fr frustrating, but whatever. I guess as a gravekeeper, having a, a nighttime sleep schedule is uh not surprising. Kind of makes sense if you think about it. All right, let's get some uh, some stone stuff up. Let's get these made. How many can I make? Probably just three with the energy I have. Oh, we only have two nails. That's gonna be a problem. Yeah, we are out of nails. So what I'm gonna want then, ore cutter? And I need a furnace real bad, but an ore cutter is probably valuable. I guess in the corner over here, bottom corner? Let's do it there. All right, I'm gonna have to swing up. I don't, wait, what? What is an ore cutter going to do for me? What do you do? Seriously, though, what am I... What? Here, get rid of this. Okay. I'm just trying to clean up space. I don't know what the ore cutter does, though. That's something the game desperately needs to start doing a little bit more of, though, and I think I talked about it a little bit on the last episode, and it's just the the, the need for the game to just, um... Yeah, let's get my body out of here. Give more, a little bit more clarity as to what does what. Too often is it, it just seems like, uh... It just kind of expects you to figure it out. Um, and again, probably due to alpha. Still, though, uh, definitely want some more, like, just a little bit more, more, like, a clarity and obviousness as to what the hell's going on. So why don't we go up top here, and then we can do another one here. Alright. I'm gonna dump you in this top grave here. Nothing personal, you know? Just trying to get everything fixed up. Okay. Alright, no, don't do that yet. Why can't I pick that up? Alright, well, let's fix up this one. That's a stone cross. This one, wooden cross. Fix gravestone. Just kind of get things working a little bit here. Okay. And then we'll get another gravestone here. Not get the ugliness kind of working out. You know, people people have their dead bodies. I'm curious who's dying so so often. I will say that. Where the bodies are coming from, I don't even know. Um, I wish I could drink from the bucket of water. White flour. Eat it. Stone repair kit. That might actually be good for the stone other the stone graves. Come on. Do I really not have enough? Damn it. I'll eat the mushrooms because I don't plan on going out to like worry about my health too much. But I, I want to get this done if possible. So can I actually fix up these with the with the stone the repair kit? I can. That's awesome. And the repair kit barely eats up any energy. Fantastic! That actually looks great now. Um all right, that is another wooden one. Can I actually repair this? I can. I only need five energy to do it? Ah, oh, I don't have enough. As long as I don't die from uh, from doing it, I'm good. Boom. Ah, oh, our graveyard's coming in, man. We're almost at minus 10. We're getting there as everything kind of comes together nicely. I wonder if these graves I can just like can't exhume them. I really don't know what I'm supposed to do with some of these things. I gotta go to the lighthouse too at some point. Why don't we... 
We're running out of time in the day. We could just go to sleep. And maybe by the time we're fully rested, uh, it'll be close to morning. And if it's not, as long as it's close to morning, I can kind of peter out the rest of the day for ourselves. Uh, until, until daylight rolls around and then we can get to work a little bit. For now, it's just a lot of just working and making things kind of run smoothly for us. I just wish there was like a quest log or something. I just don't know where the heck it, it, it the quest log is. Why do the bodies come at night, man? Stop coming at night. The bodies, they come at night. All right, feeling refreshed as always. Now I have a body. Uh, so instead of burning our energy right now, let's just set up. We'll head down here, grab the body, throw it in the morgue, and um, maybe get to working on it a little bit. What is this? Fix throw in corpse. We gotta, we gotta get a lot more stone as well. Maybe just working on stockpiling resources should be our next step. Here, let's get this. I know I said I wasn't gonna burn energy, but I don't wanna sit around and do nothing. And what happens when I run out of space in my graveyard? I mean, a body a day is gonna, it's gonna eat up a lot of space very quickly. And that does worry me too. Yeah, let's get this in. All right, we can definitely go sell that for some more money. And I also, I'm very curious what the fucking uh, Gravekeeper does with uh, with all of the uh, certificates that he ends up getting coming across due to me doing what I do. All right, I'm just gonna stockpile some resources a little bit, I think. Thank you. I kind of hope that there's gonna be a way for like faster movement that doesn't require me to dash a bunch. Because um, while he doesn't actually necessarily move slow, I almost feel like he's, he still he still moves annoyingly too slow. If that makes at all any sense, like I want to move just like a slightly bit faster. Not necessarily base off right when the game starts, but like as an upgrade or something. Whether it be getting a horse or better shoes or just leveling myself up enough to to make that happen. All right, yeah, we're definitely gonna crack start cracking these because I need the rocks. So I think we're gonna spend today doing this. A place for stones, right, but what stones? Okay, an Inquisitor. I've just seen an Inquisitor right nearby at the path to Witch Hill. Oh, sorry, he will kill me or even worse. Calm down, I'll go distract him. Maybe I'll find something on, the, on this hill that'll help me get home. On Witch Hill, what do you mean? On the road to Witch Hill? I don't know where Witch Hill is. Is Witch Hill the name of that town? We'll see. Maybe he, the Inquisitor is the bishop? I'll go take a look. I don't know where Witch Hill is, man. Oh. All right, okay. Oh, okay. Everything's ready, Monsignor. Good. Were there any problems? No, Monsignor, except there was a strange fellow snooping around. Oh, there he is. Halt. Guys, calm down. I live here at the graveyard. Oh, no, oh, Guys? Oh, no. Why, he's a cultist for the, for certain, Monsignor. Tell him you're the graveyard keeper. Tell him the bishop is a good friend. Yeah, the bishop's a good friend. You know, the archbishop is a good friend of mine. He appointed me as keeper of the local graveyard. Interesting. But can I believe you're a friend of his? Though it's not a terribly impressive feat. Just pay him a compliment and he's your friend. But appointing someone to the graveyard is certainly outside his area of responsibility. I'll have to visit him and remind him of the limits of his authority again. Would you join me at the witch burning ceremony? Sure. It would be my honor. So how'd you find yourself in such an interesting position? Uh, I'll tell you about the real world. Actually, from another world. I'm not entirely sure how I got here. I need to get back to my home, to my love. I don't think it's an appropriate time for jokes, and I don't appreciate your general demeanor. Here I am, the Great Inquisitor. I protect the one true faith of humankind itself. We're having a tough time in town. The ship of the dead is already overloaded, and there's a new one stuck in the shipyard. Your graveyard is open, opening at, again at suspiciously, a suspiciously auspicious time. The dark cult is rising. I can feel it. Righteous anger rises within it, with it in my soul. 
We haven't revealed a witch for a long time, and now we're lighting up the second one this year. It's only the beginning. Okay, you creepy dude. Burn the witch! Yeah, burn him! Burn the witch! Yes, Monsignor. Alright, well, this is, like, way more morbid than I was expecting. Long live the Great Inquisitor. Hurrah! Hurrah, hurrah! Uh... So you work with a lot of dead bodies, huh? Yeah, I think it's part of my job. And you live right beside uh, that hill near the graveyard, is that right? Yep. Interesting, interesting. You know, I need someone to be my friend here at the village. My friend is a friend of the Holy Inquisition. Villagers, they're different from us town citizens. You can't trust them. But you're new here. You might notice something unusual. Sure, I'll be your friend. Sure, it'll be a pleasure to be your friend. A wise choice. Friendship is based on trust and goodwill. Turn my trust and be a friend of the Inquisition. You will first have to show your, your goodwill. So I have a couple of minor tasks. What kind of tasks? Everything at time. Today it is a day of wrath, not a day of sweating the minor details. So we can talk on the next man's day, <laughs> or any other. I like to come here. There is no other place where I can feel my holy wrath so deeply. Cool. New task. Again, don't know how to look at my tasks. Maybe this. Oh, okay. You need to get back home, activate the portal on Witch Hill, active, talk to Astrologer about the portal. So, by looking at known NPCs, which includes myself, I can see what quests I have for them. That's really bizarre. Hey, how, that was a good burning, uh, friend. Uh, well, great, I'm glad, uh, I'm glad we burned the witch, you know what I'm saying? So this is a portal, I guess? Neat. I guess I'll see you later. Um, hopefully Gerald, Jerry doesn't, you know, just, you don't find him, want to like smash his tiny little skull into many different bits. But if you do, I know a recipe for an excellent uh, beef broth stew. But, you know, we'll use uh, human, human bone instead of beef bone. You know what I'm saying? Add some delicious, uh, like a pork, pork bone, um, ramen not too long ago. It was really, really, really good. Like, just slurped it all down, baby. Just slurped it every last drop in my mouth, down my throat. I could feel it dripping. It's hot liquid down into my belly. And I had never felt more satisfied in my life. Never, ever, ever. Okay. Well, with that said, uh, why don't we chop down or just work on some more rocks here? before nighttime rolls around. And uh, we can burn up our our stamina on this. I just don't know why there is no, uh, why I can't get no satisfaction. But also what, why I can't put my rocks on the rock holder. And I don't know if I'm supposed to be looking for a very specific rock. Also, what can I do with bone and marrow and shit? And how do I get blue stuff? I don't know, man. Anvil for 40 red, huh? Or I can just work on this. Not available in the alpha version. Why don't we get soft spares for now? We can kind of just pull them out. You know what I'm saying? We'll have to use more of our stamina to get them, I think, though. And tomorrow, I think we need to work on... Uh, we're going to have to work on two bodies instead of just the one. Not enough stamina. Can I cook anything with the raw meat that I have? Is that possible? I have buckets of water. Apparently it doesn't count. Raw sliced meat. I can... I can work on that? Alright. Well, there's just a lot of things I need to do. So we have to sleep now. But this is what I wanted, right? Sleep through the night. Hopefully wake up around dawn. Uh... And make ourselves, hopefully, uh, on, on a proper sleep schedule. But we're going to stop here. I didn't, God, this game is actually going by so fast. I'm actually really loving it. Hope you guys are enjoying If you are, let me know in the comment section below by hitting the like button. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.